Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome to another episode of Brian Starr's News. And today we're gonna talk about a crazy Arizona pastor who believes that bands like Black Sabbath, Parentera, and Judas Priest are satanic and blasphemous according to the Bible. Now the reason I call this guy crazy is because he has said some pretty outrageous stuff in the past, including uh, calling for the execution of gays so that we can have an AIDS-free world by Christmas. That was a sermon that he did uh, a few months ago. Well, in a recent sermon, uh, he explained why he thinks that bands like Black Sabbath, uh, Judas Priest, and Pantera are satanic according to the Bible. Check it out. First of all, the Talmud calls Jesus the son of Pantera at least eight times. So eight times it refers to the Lord Jesus Christ as the son of Pantera. You say, well, who's Pantera? Well, let me, it's not the metal band, you know, from the 80s. But let me tell you something. When I'm done explaining who Pantera is, you'll realize how satanic that metal band is for calling themselves that. Why are they named that? It's a blasphemous name. You know, a lot of the rock and roll uses a lot of satanic, you know, look at the names of some of these metal, you know, Judas Priest, Black Sabbath. Pantera. So yeah, what do you guys think of this? Do you think you can be a satanic band based on your name? Do you think Black Sabbath and Judas Priest are, are satanic because of their name? And uh, yeah, what do you think of this guy's comments? Personally, I'm not uh, very religious, so um, I think his comments are kind of silly. And he said some even weirder stuff during this sermon. He actually went after Jews and how they circumcise their kids. Check out that clip real quick. When we talked to the Jews today, we said, what if an adult converts unto Judaism. Are they going to need to be circumcised? And here's what they said. Well, you know, we don't, what we do is basically we just do a little pinprick with a needle until one drop of blood comes out and then we just call it circumcised. So basically, if an adult converts unto Judaism, them getting circumcised does not have anything to do with removing their foreskin. Oh no, it's just, you know, little needle, one drop of blood comes out, and we'll just call it circle. That's not what God said. That's not what Abraham did. Abraham didn't get poked with a needle. Ishmael didn't get poked with a needle. I mean, this just shows you how they're not taking what God said and following it. They've got their own man-made religion. They've got their own idea. God didn't say poke it with a needle and make a drop of blood come out. So yeah, what do you guys think of his comments? Make sure you leave a comment and let me know. If you want to see a link to the full sermon, I'll put a link in the description. Credit again to Alt Press for finding this. Very interesting sermon. I uh, don't really agree with what he said. And uh, yeah, make sure you guys subscribe to stay up to date on music news and other crazy stuff like this and uh, like the video if you enjoyed it and we'll see you guys next week on Brian Stars News.